Okay, let's give you guys some more practice. So somehow integrate this. Somehow integrate this. So press pause and um, and have a go. Okay, so to do this, hopefully you would have visualized that's one block multiplying with another block. So uh, so up to this stage, you should have a gut instinct that you should use integration by parts. Um, but the thing is, when you use integration by parts, your your next instinct would tell you to um, to make this to be your u. Because, uh, because you, you, you would have reasoned that if you make this to be your u, later on, u prime will become easier and easier. So looking at this here, if you differentiate this, it will become easier and easier. So, so when looking at this, your, your gut instinct will tell you to make this to be your, your u, because u, because u prime will become easier and easier. But the thing is, if, if you make this, if you make this to be your u, then you, you've got no choice but to make this to be your v prime. The thing is, if you make if you make this to be your v prime, later on you're going to have to integrate to get v. The thing is, you don't want to integrate this um, because if you integrate this, it becomes more complex. If you integrate natural log of x, it will give you uh, x natural log of x minus x. We've done this in the past. Uh, we've done this in the past, so you might have to track track down one of the early videos. But um, if you integrate this, it will give you this thing here. Now this thing here becomes more complex. So 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 you don't want you don't want to make this to be your your v prime. Instead, I know I know your gut instinct tells you to to make this to be your u, but you should make this to be your u. Make this to be your u, and then make this to be your your v prime. Your v prime. So uh, so yeah. You, you don't want to integrate this, so make this to be your u. So, so to integrate this whole thing here, hang on, to integrate this whole thing here, um, to integrate this whole thing here, make this to be your u instead. Because later on, when we come to differentiate it, it will be a lot easier. Okay? And then make this to be your, your v prime. Uh, so now we can, we can integrate this. So if you integrate this, it will then give you this. So now just blindly follow the instruction here. It's saying get u times v. It's saying get u times v. So that would be, uh, that would be, uh, uh, x to the power 3 over 3 plus x brackets, uh, times natural log of x. And then minus, uh, minus the integral of, it's saying get u prime times v. It's saying get u prime times v. So that would be that would be one over x times uh times this thing here x to the power three over three plus x dx. Okay so so this whole thing here will then become this will then become uh will then become this. Okay? But by the way we we're, we're calling this uh we're calling this whole thing here capital I. So it's, it's easier. So let, let's just say this whole thing here is capital I. So, uh, so this capital I here, this capital I here equals this whole thing here. So now, uh, um, now multiply this out. Uh, that will then give you this. So now this is straightforward to integrate. If you integrate this thing here, it will be this. It will be this. So this here is your final answer. Okay.